Hey guys, what is up? Reese here, and I've got a brand new sneaker pickup to show you. Well, technically it's not brand new. I actually got these over Black Friday. I just didn't have a chance to make a video at the time, but I did want to circle back around because I think it's a really good looking shoe. It's one that's been available for a while, but it's still available. So hopefully if you see this and you like these, you can still go pick up a pair in your size. What we're looking at is the Reebok GL6000 in the blue, red, white and gray colorway that released earlier in 2014. These came with a retail price of $80, but thanks to a Black Friday sale, I was actually able to get them shipped for just $35, which to me was an absolute steal. The GL6000 is a shoe that came out in 1985 as a high-tech runner, and to me it's really stood the test of time in terms of becoming like a retro shoe that just can adapt to a lot of different colorways. We've seen so many different pairs of these in the past couple years. There's also a mid-top version, and I just think it can adopt to a lot of different looks really well. And this is one of my favorite. This is the one that stood out to me the most. This is the one that first made me really seriously consider purchasing this silhouette. I remember back earlier in 2014 when I was seeing images of these, I really liked them. I just wasn't sure if I wanted to pay $80 for them, especially with all the other pairs that I did want to get. So when I found them on sale, it was just a no-brainer. I like the kind of high contrast look you have with the blue and red and then compared to the white, it's just a very clean looking shoe, but it does have that nice pop of color to give it just a really sharp look in my opinion. So like I said, I got them for like 35 bucks, crazy Black Friday sale, but they are still available at Jimmy Jazz for I think 60 bucks, so $20 off in almost a full size run. And with a place like Jimmy Jazz, you can always just Google, find a coupon or two, and then get your order down even more. So if you wanna pick up a pair, I'll put the link below, but then don't forget to look for additional coupons to save yourself some extra money. With all that said, let's dive into a close-up view, and I'll show you the colors, materials, and everything going on with this shoe. Here we go with our close-up look of the Reebok GL6000 in this nice blue, red, white, and gray colorway. You have three main colors on the upper and three main materials, and those correspond really well. Wherever you see white, You've got this nice, just simple white mesh, nothing too crazy. You can see it right there, also back there, up there, and on the tongue. This blue is a blue suede, and it's not the nicest suede ever. There's not like anything really wrong with it. It did come with this um, little scuff right there, but other than that, it's just like, you know, I've seen better suede. It's not like it's bad or anything. Um, also, there were just like some blue fibers from it that I had to like brush off the toe box area, but that wasn't that big of a deal. And then wherever you see red back here, except for this little plastic heel cup, it's actually a cracked leather, which is really interesting. I've never seen that before. I'll try to get close here, let the camera focus. I don't think it's gonna pick it up very well though, so I'll throw in a picture right now. But it's just, that's something I've never seen before, which I thought was kind of cool. Um, so yeah, I'll uh, throw in that picture again, like I said. Um, here on the top of the tongue, you've got this little tag, um, like a lot of older Reeboks says Reebok Classic. And you've got this um, arrow logo right here. I don't actually know what this symbolizes, so if anyone does, let me know in the comments below. I have these blue laces with red lace tips in the shoe right now. They did also come with a set of white laces that had a blue tip, um, and I meant to bring those home so I could show you and compare the two, but I'm on Christmas break, did not bring the laces home with me, so just use your imagination. Right here you've got your logo, it's Reebok and then the Union Jack, or your branding, excuse me. Back here, you've got the GL6000 text wrapping around. And then here, top of the heel, it says Reebok in white. And you've got this plastic heel cup down here in red. The midsole features two colors. You've got white and then you've got, where you've got some slightly different foam. You can see gray right there and right there. It also says Reebok right there, just molded into the white. The outsole is like a light gray. You can see I've worn these a little bit. It says Reebok. Um, and also right there, let you know these are have a non-marking outsole. I have not cared about that since like third grade, but I need to get a pair of non-marking shoes for PE class. But if that's something that's important to you, there it is. Um, and yeah, oh, white lining, white insole, it says Reebok. Um, so that about does it for this shoe. Like I said, I will post a link below to where I purchased these so you can go grab them for under retail right now. Um, thank you very much for watching this guys. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and have a great day.